also a, a very noted environmentalist, not only here uh, in the Philippines, the author of the Clean Air and Clean Water Act of our country, a former congressman also from Bukidnon, a stalwart of the Liberal Party. Uh, let's all welcome former congressman Neri Cajosta. Magandang magandang tanghali po sa ating lahat. At uulitin ko po at uh, susugan ang sinabi ni Congressman Gingona. Ang aming taus-puso pong pagpapasalamat sa inyong lahat. At sa kaya natin ang diwa na kung kaya po nating isipin, kaya po nating gawin. Palakpakan na po natin ang ating mga champions. Over a year ago, it was probably not conceivable that a group like this would be able to, on their own, little way, travel the country, talk to students, go to campuses, different communities. Iilan lamang, uh, nangunguna dito, siyempre sila ni Mayor Jesse, sila ni Mayor Sonia, sila ni Governor Grace, Governor Panlilio, Governor Teddy, at lahat ng mga mayors na sumali na rin. At kami, at inimbitaan nila, nila rin kami ni uh, TG. Uh, it was in many ways with Harvey's uh, constant, constant encouragement. Kaminsan, magpupulitan na nga kami ni Harvey. Kahit linggo, kahit hating gabi. Because that was the spirit that was driving a small group. But as they say, never underestimate the power of a few committed individuals to change the world because nothing ever really has changed the world except the power of a few committed individuals that causes the ripples of change and hope towards the larger communities and country as a whole. Kaya natin essentially banishes the whole sense of what we call, what I call, a culture of nalangness. Wag na lang, sila na lang, hayaan na lang, pare-pareho lang naman yan silang lahat eh. So dadayain na lang, peperahin na lang, o kung ayaw na natin, o pagod na tayo, mag-abroad na lang. Na lang limits our sense of the possibilities that we have as a people and as Filipinos. And it is kaya natin that banishes that and says we have it in ourselves to reverse this sense of Perhaps not yet hopelessness, but often enough a sense of helplessness. And we get tired and jaded. We get cynical. And we think, ganun lang din naman eh, hindi din man magbabago. But kaya natin says, hindi. Nasa sa atin ang kakayanan, ang kabutihang loob, at ang kagalingan bawat ng bawat Pilipino na manahig ang tama at uh, mawala rin ang mga baluktot at tiwali ng mga paraan at ng pamamahala. I would like to just offer you a little portion, a stanza from Francisco Balantas, who is our Filipino Shakespeare. Because it was the work of Francisco Balantas, siya po, magaling ang makata, Filipino Shakespeare, who wrote Florante at Laura. At yung Florante at Laura ay isang kwento, hindi lang sa pag-ibig ni Florante at ni Laura, kung hindi pag-ibig sa tinubuang lupa. At ito ang naging inspirasyon ni Jose Rizal nung isinulat niya ang Noli Mitangere at ang Ilipulibusterismo at naging inspirasyon din ni Apolinario Mabini nung siya ay nag-exile sa Guam. And this is really what kaya natin moves with in terms of the challenges that we face. And it is the same spirit that drives us in the Liberal Party and in our networks that go beyond the partisan parameters of a party like the Liberal Party. Kaya natin being one of those movements as well. Stanza 14 of Florante at Laura goes, 250 years ago, but look how resonant it still is to this very day. Sa loob at sa labas ng bayan kong sawi, kaliluhay siyang nangyayaring hari. Kagaling at bait ay nalulugami, ininis at inilibing sa dusang bigati. 
Inside and outside my suffering country, treachery is king. Goodness and excellence are weakened and buried in anguish and misery. Indeed, it is the goodness and the excellence of every Filipino that gets weakened. And in regime and administration and government over time, and governments over time, that kind of goodness and excellence that are inherent in all of us get buried. Get buried in cynicism and in a sense of hopelessness. Get buried in that sense of nalangness. Kaya po, sa kaya natin, if we can really imagine a different future, a different set of leaders, if we can imagine a different country and a different energy that will guide our sense of being a country and a nation in 2010 and beyond, then kaya po natin gawin. Because as Rizal believed in all of our heroes, down to Ninoy Aquino and Cory Aquino, we just have to believe in ourselves and keep faith with what is good and what is excellent in ourselves. It is treachery, ang kaliluhay siyang nangyayaring hari, when we see that some of our leaders at the very highest echelons of government lie and cheat and steal. It is treachery when we see the destruction of our natural resources and the patrimony of our ecology. It is treachery when we see that our youth have to leave this country, that we should always love, but somehow give up on it and build the economies of other countries. It is treachery when the institutions of government, including even the justice system, becomes tools for harassment. It becomes nagiging kasangkapan po para lang may selective justice. It is treachery when we see that there is a sense of cynicism that permeates the body politic. And so today, with this sense of what is possible, ito po ay napakalaking karangalan na tinatanggap ko rin po ang hamon na maging isa sa mga tinig ng Mindanao at tinig din po ng kabataan at ng panibago at kakaibang kinabukasan kasama po si Congressman Gingona para sa pagtakbo ng Senata Senato. Salamat, salamat po. And so if we can believe it, if we can dream it, we can do it. And I end with this, as Einstein was a great scientist would say, and he was more than a scientist, he was a humanist. At sabi po niya, higit pa sa dunong, higit pa sa kalaman po, ay ang imagination. Pananaw na malalim po ang nakikita, malayo ang nakikita, at malalim po ang Hinahangal. And that is truly what we need. But that is what we believe we can do. Kung kaya po natin isipin, kaya natin gawin. Maraming maraming salamat po sa ating lahat.